of what may have become of his wonderful music. No one knows. This is a song I wrote now, a love song for my wife, Bina. with the yearning of all men. Among the faceless streets of shadowed England, owning the broad daylight of my pain, owning the broad daylight of my pain. God's ardor, who can out shuffle every shift of the cards among the tangled roads of nettled England? How sweetly blooms the rose among old graves. Sweetly blooms the rose among old graveyards. If love can clasp or fathom to some ultimate stand. Neither pity nor desire can tell. Among the lonesome crowds of familiar England, knowing every kiss is a kiss of farewell. Knowing every kiss is a kiss of farewell. The evergreenness of things, the patternlessness and the perfect lack of symmetry. Among the sad, sad markings of heartless England, till my heart shall cease to seek to make bargains for me. My heart shall cease to seek to make bargains for me. Rolling out the toes. Many a good mile under them is here before you. I do stand. Ah, anyone might take a me for the son of a duke or a gentleman. Oh, the old shark time way earning. I got it off of an old scarecrow. Many happy nights it's seen and many happy days also. If it wasn't for the sleeves being gone, as here before you, I do stand. Anyone might take me for the son of a duke or a gentleman. Oh, I wish I'd a gallon of brandy or sugar, maybe twenty pounds, and a great big bowl to mix it in, and a great big stick to stir it round. I'd drink a health to the company, whether near or 
far away. But since they have not, well, how about this then? <laughs> of Inerleithen, where I used to live for years and years, years ago, there was a wonderful tailor, the greatest tailor in all the countryside, but he had a fault, and a bad fault too. He used to dress like a beggar man. One day the Lord Mayor called him in and he says, Taylor, Taylor, we'll give you a roll of the finest tweed, only make yourself a decent suit for the love of God. The tailor said, right, I'll make it. He took the roll of tweed, rolled it out onto his shearing board, and he snip it, and he snip it, and he snip it, and he snip it. He made himself the most beautiful suit you ever saw. When he wore that suit walking down the street, people said, Oh, what a lovely suit. He wore it till it was in rags. <laughs> he thought, I'll make something wonderful out of it. He laid it onto the shearing board, and he snip it, and he snip it, and he snip it, and he snip it. He made himself the most beautiful waistcoat that you ever saw. When he wore that waistcoat walking down the street, people said, Oh, it's just lovely, isn't it? He wore it till it was in rags and tatters. He thought, I'll make something wonderful out of it. He laid on the shearing board, and he snipped it, and he snipped it, and he snipped it, and he snipped it, and he made himself the most beautiful hat you ever saw. When he wore that walking down the road, people said, My, 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 that really defines the term hat for me. <laughs> Well, he wore this hat till you wouldn't want to plant flowers on it. <laughs> he thought, oh, well, I'll make something wonderful out of it. He laid it on the shearing board and he snipped it and he snipped it and he snipped it and he snipped it. He made himself the most beautiful button that you ever saw. <laughs> he tied it onto what was left of his shirt. When he wore that button, walking down the street, people said, that button, you know, it's like, oh, it's like cosmic. <laughs> Word this button till you couldn't even see it at all. He thought, I'll make something wonderful out of it. And out of that button, he made a story. Credit the years with a drive of nails to make bare the words that are not to be you. But cherish the fable that floats of steel, melt sorrow again, melt sorrow again in the ancient sea. To the rich man's madness and the poor man's curse. Women and men are the wheels of the world. Land blood again, land blood again. In the ancient. Again, 
to the ancient tree.